everybody. How are you? Happy to happy to quarantine. Happy quarantine class number four. So today, I liked the suggestion today. It's actually perfect. So I am um, uh, heading to the gym in my basement and uh, I thought I should do my makeup. <laughs> so uh, let me just get my lips settled here. They're still crazy. I don't know what to do. Hello, mother. Hopefully you and dad are staying home. You know, I yell at you every freaking day. And yeah, so I'm just gonna get, I will FaceTime you guys later. Rod has been busy this morning getting our fridge in the basement from his friend. So we got a new fridge in the basement. Hello, Lakita. Okay, so today's look, hello. Um, today's look is like a, makeup, no makeup look. So I don't even know what products I'm going to use yet, but I'm going to start with skincare because I always do. So let's start with our skincare. Hey, homie. Hey, here to entertain at least for 40 minutes or so, probably. I'll go slow today, make it a nice long quarantine class. Yesterday was brows. Uh, what else have I done? Eyeshadow looks. Uh, I think the first two days were eyeshadow looks, I believe. Um, I haven't done the 80s look yet because I want Becky to be available so I can bring her on the camera. Um, hey, Brenda, here's your suggestion. So I'm still deciding on what I'm going to do. I am definitely putting on my skincare, though, because I don't care if I am inside or not. My skin's got to be taken care of. So, hey, Samantha. Oh, it's so great. All my peeps are here. Hey, hey. So, and just so you guys know, like, I literally cried yesterday. I'm a bit emotional. There's a lot of emotions running through us all right now, right? So, when Derek, who is our CEO, he announced that the whole website is free, you guys. Even the presenter kit or the beauty box. Like, everything ships free. I don't think you understand, like, the realm of that as much as, like... Like we get paid in three hours. So when we make a sale from our site, we get paid three hours later, which is like unheard of. Like they're not even paid at corporate by the banks for like a couple of days and they still pay us ahead of time. The other thing that they do, like right now, like it's to do free shipping right now is crazy. Like when I ship a mascara, I shipped a mascara this morning and I shipped a concealer this morning. Like when I ship those things out, the company loses money. They lose money because the shipping cost is, um, they cover part of the shipping cost, first of all. And the second part is that now that there's no shipping cost, they're covering a lot of money to send like a small product. Because I know that shipping like those two products here in Canada, if I took a mascara to an actual like postal person and didn't slide it in the mailbox myself, they charge $15, $15 for a freaking mascara. Um, so I know for a fact they are losing money by doing this, but Derek feels like the best way to have social isolation and to keep us home because like our livelihood depends on shipping products out. I don't have to go to a mailbox or even a post office or whatever the option is in your area. I have to do that because I've now been given the opportunity to ship directly from my site for free for a whole week, guys. And it just started yesterday. Hello, Lisa. Okay, so let's do, like I said, we're gonna do a uh, makeup, no makeup look. Hey, Orla, how is Ireland? Is it crazy there? Um, so I was thinking, I was thinking it would be a good day for a little BB cream. Oh, mine's almost empty. That was weird. Um, maybe baby, well, maybe you might have an option. Oh, I think I got some in here. Um, I am going to use the BB cream actually with our new primer. I'm still using this primer with absolutely everything. Stephanie, how are you? Are you home? Stephanie left for a trip right before this shenanigans to Florida. Are you stuck in Florida? What is your situation? Tell me everything. She was going there for a nice vacation for three weeks and I'm wondering where you've been. I love my BB cream. Yeah, BB cream is a great product for a no makeup makeup look. This primer is everything, so let's try it for the first time today with the BB cream. I've tried it with the spray foundation. It's absolutely insane. Cut the top off and you'll be able to get out more. Yes, that is key. I will do that. I think I'll be able to get some out. I just feels empty. I don't need a lot though. Like a lot goes a long way with it, so 
All right, but I'm not starting with that anyways. We're gonna start with our eyes. So I was thinking like something like a, she wanted like a glowy, so Brenda said glowy, no makeup, makeup look. So I'm still gonna wear a little bit of eyeshadow, but I'm not gonna go crazy. So I'm thinking, I'm thinking I'm gonna pop back out with palette one. I'm gonna pop back out palette one. Brad and his friend need to keep it quiet and they need to social distance. I don't know why they're in the house together. Um, where is my, there it is. All right. What? I'm in live. So keep it down. You see that? Put them in his place. Hello, Brie. Okay. So we are going to do palette one because like, if we're going to do like a no makeup makeup look, we need to use like some neutrals. So, um, I am going to grab a chipper which is a transition color. Ooh, I didn't put primer on. Hold on. Now that I know I have one coming, thanks to Kathy. And that's ship Kathy, so I will let you know. So you can go for a drive if you want with a porch pickup. If you need to get out of the house, which I'm sure you do. Like everybody feels like they need to at some point. Those are pretty colors, yes. Yeah, bro, I'd be quiet. I know, like, I'm like, why are you even talking? Usually when I'm live, you're not even home. And now you're home all the time. Okay, so let's grab a uh, chipper. Like, I don't even know why he's a friend over right now. I get it, he helped him bring down a fridge downstairs because Sarah Mandia was not having any part of carrying a fridge. Um, and he wanted, this guy wanted it out of his house. I only let him in because he works alone. He doesn't work with anybody else. And so therefore I feel like he is hopefully not bringing germs into my house, but anywho, I haven't even gone anywhere near him. Now I'm gonna tell Brad to wash his damn hands after his friend leaves. And that's it. Okay, so we're just gonna do like a really light brown. So just as a no makeup makeup look, I kind of want to have like a, like a golden, color okay so that's probably more than enough and that's the transition color so that's like the light lighter brown in here i'm gonna blend that out a lot so hey kim hey ashley what who would have thought it'd been your workout for the day bro mad gains yeah right oh my god the fridge looks so heavy i was like no i'm not having any part of that well, he was like originally gonna go get it and get it off his truck himself and just put it in the garage. But then his friend offered to just drive back here and help him, so. It is what it is, but that's, I mean, we're just gonna have to deal, you know? But I'm not going anywhere. I'm just going to the basement to do my workout right after this, but it's great because if I do my makeup prior to the workout, then I only need to shower once for today. But I can't stress you guys enough to just try and like stay in a routine because man, I love my routine and I just feel like I'm kind of still in it. But I'm also loving my new routine of not having to uh, get up at 4.45 in the morning to work out and I can get used to that. And not having to, um, I'm like having my coffee and breakfast before I work out, so. And I also am watching the show Hunters. I don't know if you guys have seen it, but it's like intense. And watching that at 4.45 in the morning has been creeping me out. Christy, using your little trick, guys, to clean my sponge. Get off all my colors. Okay, so I'm gonna grab for a bronzy look. I'm gonna get this swanky color, okay? So, and just kinda use that on my lid. Keep it like a bronzy makeup, no makeup look. So, I am not gonna wear like liquid liner today. I'm just going to um, do my best to uh, have it as a no makeup glow up kind of thing. All right, what would have been your workout for the day? Hey, show me. Show how well it stays on after your workout. It's the best trick ever. <laughs> yeah, I will. Honestly, my workout, pff, I'm like, and I'll be sweating because today is a run day. So I do intervals. I do 31 seconds on, 18 seconds off. And I do that for about 45 minutes. 
Now I get mad sweats. I'm coming out of quarantine jacked, ladies. <laughs> okay, so, you know what? I'm gonna add a bit more swanky. Just to kinda finish her up, and then I'm gonna grab my brush, and I'm gonna touch the brown again, and I'm just gonna blend that out a little bit. There we go. There we go. There, so some bronzy glow up eyes. So is the lighting okay? Because I know that the sun's blurring in my face and I can barely see my screen. So summer buddy, what? Well, I mean, we're gonna try and get pregnant again next month. I was like, dude, putting it on hold now. Cause I do not want to deal with hospitals right now. So we put this month on hold. All right, so we've got some great lighting here to just for me to grab a few friends. I canceled my wax appointment for my brows and my mustache, so don't look at that right now, um, for next week, obviously, because I don't want anyone near me. I'm all about keeping it, keeping it real, keeping it. The eyebrows, I feel like I can manage only for so long, but I'm hoping like three weeks to a month will be enough. There we go. Okay, so there we go. My eyebrows are somewhat cleaned up as best I can. So what are you guys doing today? What is like your thing? What's keeping you busy in quarantine? I wanna know because like maybe I need some ideas. I'm keeping super busy with work so it hasn't really affected me. My March break looked probably just, just the only thing that looked a little bit different for my March break was that I wasn't able to go uh, to Pembroke for a team dinner and I wasn't able to host my Empower Rally at my school on a Saturday. So I actually just like, other than that, I probably would have done a lot of staying home like I did. For some pamper products, do it up. We have some awesome face masks. I'm gonna do a face mask for sure. Uh, like, it's just like, I just feel like all of a sudden I have all this time to do everything and it's just like, so nice. And other essentials, milk, eggs, bread, toilet paper. I mean, I don't know. Probably the grocery, who's been to a grocery store lately? I heard the shelves are like super empty. I'm gonna continue to try and use um, the pickup option. I think it's still working as of right now here. Um, I talked about that a little bit in a few posts and people are like all over me, like it's not an option anymore. I'm like, okay, sorry. Um, I mean, if it's a week out, it's a week out. So why don't you put an order in a week out? There as fuck, okay, it's too bad. Yeah, cause I think, I mean, I don't know why Doug Ford's like, don't overbuy, we're gonna have so much. It's because people like overbought everything. I mean, we have enough groceries for probably for like two weeks maybe. So. But I mean, I hope that they're able to get some like the essentials in. Because some people don't have a place to store all their like overbought food, right? It's not really fair. I know if I was still living in my condo, we just had the fridge. And now, now all we really have, we have a, we have a deep freezer, but it's a small deep freezer. So now we have an extra fridge in the basement, which is kind of nice for sure. Really, if I'm, if I'm real, it'd be more of like a beer fridge down there, which I can't wait to get the beer out of the fridge up here. And it'll be like an extra freezer, which is huge. So we do have, both our freezers are pretty full. So yeah, we're pretty good for food. I'm not going anywhere near a grocery store anytime soon. But I saw that Doug Ford like took the ban off. Who knew there was even a ban for trucks coming in? I worked all week. Ryan has gone to Farm Boy. He found all we needed food wise. Yeah, Farm Boy, I went, I will be real with you guys on Monday. I had to go to Farm Boy for um, three things. It was freaking packed. They did have everything there as well. That I didn't need like essentials or anything, but I did notice that they had most things. And they did have all sorts of old people shopping and I lost my freaking mind and had to get out of there. I was so uncomfortable. 
I worked all week. Now I'm just relaxing after getting groceries. Okay. Hey, Anne. Like for real, the images on the news are legit. Bare shells for toilet paper. Meats are mostly bunkered. Um, they said they are still getting shipments, so that's good. Yeah, I know. But I like you're like everyone keeps telling me that the shelves are just empty. So if we're still getting shipments. Where are they? People are starting to lose their minds out there. I think so I went Thursday the Thursday night before school ended before the March break and did a grocery run and then I went on Monday of March break so last Monday I went to Costco and I went to a I had a grocery pickup that I placed and then I did um I did a really quick run Thursday, I wanna say. Yeah, Thursday. Just to Farm Boy and that's it. And literally, like when I say quick run, I got four things, three things, four things. All right. Oh, Brad's making his truck go straight in the driveway. Okay, so here's a little tip, cause I'm gonna do like a lash, how to get really long lashes. But if you want really long lashes, if you were a light liner, um, underneath, or sorry, a light, oh, shut up, Teddy. If you were a light eyeshadow, it really helps to pop your lashes. Okay, so we're doing that for our glow up today. Teddy, enough! I will fight you. Good, Brad's friend left. It's enough friends over. I haven't had any friends over. Okay, we went today and the shelves aren't empty. Okay, good. That's good. If I go to the mall for groceries, I'll send you a pic. Different stores in Pembroke are in the process of restocking their shelves. I mean, there's always food options, right? Tedster, yeah, Tedster needs to shut his mouth. He did though, so he listened really well when I yelled at him. Okay, let's, why is the lighting going crazy? There we go. Okay, so, so far, glow up eyes, I love. Okay, so let's do um, just a basic BB cream. So we've got the primer on. I'm actually really excited to try the primer using our BB cream. So we are good. Thanks, Sarah. <laughs> okay, mom. You're good for food. Is that what you're trying to tell me? Yeah, because you guys went to Costco, even though I told you not to. You are not listening to your daughter. I'm going to add, here's a little Trixie. I'm going to grab some of this. Okay, so I've got BB cream on here, and what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna add just a dab of our Scarlet Concealer. Because I find the honey, I find bisque is too light, and I find honey is too dark, but the in-between with a bit of Scarlet added, it makes the perfect shade for me. Okay, so this is, oh, I like how this is going on with the primer. Talk to me. So this is just a BB cream. So again, we're doing a no makeup makeup look. And our BB cream is a tinted moisturizer. And it's honestly, it's so nice. Just like a light coverage. You don't need a lot. You're not gonna get, a, you don't, you're not gonna get a super full coverage with a BB cream, but that's okay because it makes me look, it makes me feel like I've got a bit of coverage, but it's nothing crazy. If you want a full coverage look, you could easily use our BB cream. See how dark it is for me? You can see it on my neck. But blend it out, it does the job. There we go. Okay, I also didn't supervise Brad bringing that fridge downstairs. He better not have put it in my skip rope area. I will be very sad. Trials and tribulations of living full time with your husband now that he is off work. Okay, I'm just gonna grab my kabuk because why wouldn't I grab my kabuki for every possible blending option? If you don't have this brush, it's sold out, but <laughs> you should get one. You should get on a pre-order list. There, okay, so it's like the perfect, just like light coverage, nothing crazy. Now, let's be real, my, my under eye circles are gonna need some coverage. 
We are good, Sarah. Took advantage of the free shipping. Got some stick foundations. Oh, nice. Thanks for your order, Sharon. I appreciate you. Oh, the stick is like bomb.com. Sticks are like the key. I love the sticks. Yeah, the free shipping is crazy. Like I was like, holy, like I just, it just made me cry because I just, I love our CEO so much. They are such good people. And like you could work for companies and I'm sure we have all, me included, worked for other, not companies, but like bosses or people that are just like, don't give a shit about anybody but themselves. I will tell you, I have never met so many such gracious, like all Derek cares about right now is taking care of his peeps which is all of us. So, I mean, most CEOs, I don't think they would be doing something like this right now. This was not planned. He planned this because of um, the, the coronavirus. So, you know it wasn't done so that he boosted sales, which it's going to do, but they're losing a poop ton of money. Guys, I'm telling you, knowing how expensive shipping is in Canada, just in general, they ain't making money. I use BB cream, then my stick for extra under my eyes. It's perfect. Nice. Yeah, so if I want an extra, which I don't, I'm good with the coverage I got right now. I added a touch of the concealer to my um, BB cream before I applied. And then now I always, you know me, I really have dark circles under my eyes. So I don't know if that's my French or Italian side, but it is exactly what I needed to have underneath my eyes. So um, I'm just gonna blend that out. Guys, I get so excited for these lives every day. I'm like, ooh, what time can I plan it for today? I actually planned it out and like made an announcement today instead of just jumping on here, which I did yesterday, but I think I was in a rush yesterday. I don't know why I was in a rush. I don't know what I would have been doing, but anyway. Okay. So this Friday, even though it's Saturday, so it's a long time away, I'm gonna be giving away wands on Foxy Bay, for Foxy Bay on Friday. So man, ladies, let's share the crap out of it. I'd love to be able to give away a bunch of wands at a time like this. So that is happening on Friday. Oh, I'm supposed to get one of those, I don't know if you guys have seen the advertisements, Madison Braids sent me one of those cool braids. I don't know, I should go and check the mailbox. They sent me one like last week, I think. And she messaged me yesterday. She has a really cute discount on it. I can't braid my hair with shit. Like I literally can't braid it all. So I'm actually excited to go check it out. Long live the online businesses. I had a lot of people reach out to me today that cause like Mac and Sephora and these stores are closed and I don't think they's offering free shipping. So I'm bringing people over to the dark side of uniquing <laughs> okay so the other big rumor i heard and i'm praying it's not true is that our bronzer is going away i heard this rumor yesterday i did not like any part of it i wish that i had malibu um, but it's been sold out for i don't even know how long oh my god and i lost it i was gonna use it today and i literally just remembered right now unless hold on team hold on Oh my god, like I literally don't know where my bronzer went. Like who loses a bronzer? Okay, let's let's play find the bronzer today. Because I did I remember one morning I was looking for it and I'm like I just ran out of time. Oh, I found it. It was hiding at the very back of my drawer. I saw the Madison braids. Yeah, they're cute, eh? So I'm pretty excited. What time, homie? I should get a one. Oh my God, Kathy has a shaved head and she just likes to be a comedian. Um, but I'm sure maybe Jen would like it. Jen would like anything you give her. Um, yeah, they're cute, eh? The Madison Braids. I'm really excited to get mine, so I'm hoping it arrived. I just have to go check my damn mailbox. I didn't go yesterday. Okay, what brush do I wanna use? Let's use this one. Okay, so we're gonna do um some bronzer because we're gonna do like a bronze up no makeup look so i'm gonna just grab now again i wish that i had the um i wish that i had the freaking malibu but that's okay i'm gonna work work with what i got and 
just use this one. This is Hermosa. So this is where you wear bronzer, ladies. You're gonna wear it like towards the, like the top part of your head. It's a three, one, two, three. This is where else you'd wanna wear it. And this is like the epitome of a glow up. Like if you wanna wear something that's gonna make you glow, you wear our bronzers. So again, I have heard heavy rumors they're going away. Now, I believe they're going away because we're getting something else. And I do believe, like I said, Malibu's been sold out. I don't even know how long. I heard Sunset was sold out as well. Okay, so we got a nice like contour with some bronzer. Easy peasy. Okay. What time for the Foxy Bay Live on Friday or don't know yet? Uh, I believe it's 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I'm like, I'm pretty sure I'm the last one before the weekend. I like to try and snag that spot because sometimes I know they'll, well, I know with Foxy or when I was with the other company, Lange, they had, it was a good time slot to have. Because you stay at the top of their page usually. But So I strategically picked that time slot. Okay. There we go. All right. So I'm going to grab a little bit of setting powder because you know me. I like to set. I like to set it up. All right. Sorry. I'm just organizing. I hate clutter. I have like everything. Once you have a vanity and everything has a spot, you like, it's hard to like work when things are not in their spots. Hence when I lost my bronzer, I'm like, how, how do I lose something when everything has a spot? What time for the, okay, that's I already answered that. I just wanna make sure I didn't miss any questions. Okay, so again, what else have you guys been doing with your quarantine time? Like, I feel like I am, like I haven't read anything. I think I'm gonna have to, I don't know what's gonna be expected of us on Monday. Like it said to like contact your all your students. I'm like, uh, no, I have 150, so that's not happening. So I'm gonna send a mass email to like the classes but I am definitely not contacting all of them individually. They're out of their minds. So I'm gonna contact, um, I'm gonna contact them via email. I'm pretty sure the parents should be getting an email as well that we'll be contacting hopefully through email. I am glad that I have embodied the online Hapara course because that's how I'm gonna teach it because I can only imagine some of the old school teachers right now that don't use online things to teach, they're, they're screwed. Okay, so let's do a, just a touch of, so this isn't sold anymore. I've had a lot of requests, or maybe I'll do actually one that we do have on the website. Oh, the pearly one's so nice, but it's so dark. Um, let's do this one. I have so many highlighters, guys. <sighs> Lustrous. All right, so this is a kind of a rose gold. You can get this on the site. So I want to do things that you can still get. Okay, so I kind of just put that on there. I'm definitely going to need a brush to blend that out. Is the same. Uh, hold on. Guys, have you cleaned yet? Like I haven't cleaned anything. <laughs> I don't want to. There we go. And there we go. Just kind of blend that out in the highlight area. Okay. Just to give me a bit more of a glow. And then I'm gonna take I'm still gonna use this one because I, even though it is long gone, I am gonna use it. I don't know if anybody has one of these at home. 
Don't be surprised if some girls on my team are hoarding these. go my gold I don't have that cute button now so I always think this looks weird but I love this like a brush because it gives you like a, a lot more control <laughs> and you can be messy with your highlighter there we go. Okay, so we got like a lots of like goldy colors. Can you guys see that? Because we're doing a glow up. All right. Now, well, like I basically just have to do my eyebrows and a nice gloss of some sort, and we are doing the no makeup makeup look. We are done. And I didn't even use that many products. There we go. And this is like, I talked about this in my brow tutorial yesterday too. If you like are like, oh my God, my brows are a hot mess because your brow lady's off. Just get, like if you fill in your brows and then pluck around where you would want them to be, it makes it easy. I've been trying to get over my anxiety of going live. I need to start doing them again. Yes, don't be shy. Tell us when you're going live. We'll come on and hang out. Honestly, you need this now more than ever is this like minimal social interaction. Me and my girlfriend tonight are having a wine party at 8.30 p.m. on our, uh, we're doing it on Messenger. Because in Messenger, if you make a group, guys, you can all go on FaceTime together. You can do it on FaceTime too, but I've been hearing, um, just like from reading stuff online, that FaceTime has been really glitchy. So just so you know, you can do it on Messenger as well. And uh, just to hang out and see faces. It's one thing to text all day. It's a whole other thing to see people like this, right? So like I see me, I don't see any of you guys. But this gives me such relief in my, because I'm a social person. I'm an introvert. I feel like I'm an introvert extrovert. When people are like, are you an introvert or an extrovert? I do feel like I'm more extrovert than introvert, but I love staying home. Like I could stay home. Like I'm a homebody extrovert. I don't know what the name is. We need to make up a new name for what I am. Like I can sit in conversations. I mean, I do it every day with Kathy at work when we're working. Like I can sit and just listen to the guys for like the whole morning. And then other times I feel like I need to chime in. So I go back and forth. So I don't know. Maybe it's because I'm trying to work on my listening skills. We were talking about a friend of mine's uh, boyfriend who he literally has the worst listening skills of life. Like, you know those people that just listen to like tell you something? Like they don't actually listen to what you say. He's like one of those. He like waits for his turn to talk. but actually he's not listening. It's very weird. Okay. I'm gonna try and brush these out just a touch today. Just a touch. Doing eyebrows is like, it's like an art. There. Just wanted to brush them out just a touch, just like so they're not as intense, but like that's my eyebrows. Okay. Your lives are replacing the morning circle. They are, but like we don't have like Tom's terrible jokes and we don't have Mike's complaining and we don't have Gervasi is just listening because he doesn't say much. And then we don't have like oh and Paul's like tidbits and Mario like in his weirdness like we're missing all those things we're missing all those things like I love them all individually the thing I was actually thinking about yesterday and I know there's been posts about it and stuff too is like 
kids are going to be like, okay, first of all, kids are going to love school way more now. Second of all, um, like the nostalgia, well, they will get over this like, oh, awesome. I got extra weeks off. They get bored and they can't be with their friends as long as their parents are doing their job. So like, this is probably killing some of them. Um, I also have some kids that are so cute and just love school. So I'm excited for them to, to give them work because they've been asking me for work. Um, and then there's also the like people that just like hated their job. They're going to be so much more appreciative of that job. Or they're going to be like, I hate my freaking job. It's time for a change. Being away from it showed me why it was good for me, right? So there's like a lot of good that can come out of the things that are happening right now. I know that sounds crazy. As long as you're doing your part um, by staying home and, you know, social isolating and doing your part, I don't see why. Sorry, I have stuff all over me. Um, like I feel like as long as I'm safe and my family's safe, we're good. We're totally good. Oh, there's a girl oh she's in a wheelchair that's not fun right now her brother's walking her she's got a broken leg just creeping on people outside my window but like I feel like it's just there's there's like as when we get over all this because guys we will we will all get through this I promise people are going to be a lot more appreciative of people hopefully nicer to people hopefully things that will learn some things from this you know okay I'm going to use something else that's like a no more product but I think it would be perfect for this look. These are our, these were our metallic lip splashes that were here for a short time. I don't want them to be, I don't want it to be too intense though. All right. So this is your no makeup makeup look where it's like a glow up, where it's just kind of like bronzy. I feel like I should be like going to the pool. I feel like it should be the summertime. I'm sad that it's done because now I have to go work out, but that's okay because I move my body and I'll feel good. Guys, go try and move your body today. I have a really good post if you're not in my um, beauty, like boss, boss beauty confidence corner group. If you're not in there, I have a really good post going up about eight o'clock tonight just to help you get through this. Hopefully it helps somebody. That's gorgeous. I know it's pretty, eh? But are you talking about the lipstick? This was our, um, oh God, what color is this one? Superior. So we had a whole line of these. I actually have lots of them in here. This was another one that we had. Um, these were fun. These were real fun. So it gave us like sort of like a metallic look and they don't budge. Actually, I might put a touch of lip gloss. Just in the middle there. Perfect, okay. Love you guys, thank you for joining me and I will 100% be here again tomorrow. Um, I don't know what we should do tomorrow, so maybe if Becky's available, we can do uh, the 80s live. And if not, then please give me an idea of something you wanna see, cause I got some time. Um, we could do like a crazy look with palette seven. We could do um, a glammed up ball look. Like, I don't know, just give me ideas and I'm here. But I love you guys and I'll see you tomorrow and probably in my stories all day, cause what else am I doing? Or on my TikToks. I made a lot of TikToks yesterday. Love you.